So Isaiah TG is an artist that has been very influential to the underground these past couple of years. He's really known for his dark and somber music or making a song on any beat and at least making a decent song. And Isaiah TG is an artist that I'm really interested in right now but don't know too much about which is the reason why I'm making this video so let's get into where Isaiah TG really started. Is it toxic that I love when she said about me? That just means she mean when she said Born November 14th of 2001 was Isaiah TG. When Isaiah was growing up, he lived in a Christian household, so his mom didn't really allow him to listen to things like rap. He grew up listening to a lot of country, radio pop, and Christian music. But he would also transition into more trap music like Young Thug, Rich Homie Kwan, or Chief Keef. But at the age of 15, he would be set up by his friends and experience a traumatic incident that would lead him to getting schizophrenia. But this will also be around the time where he would start making music and posting stuff on SoundCloud, with some of his inspirations being x cardi lucky and etc with his earliest song up today from 2019 that's called hashtag slay hashtag gym soldier which he would be referring to the collective that he was in that's called slay world or hell world at the time he would join the collective through one of the founders named goonie and therefore they will all really just run the underground from there isaiah will also have collabs with some of the members like can can summers or yeet and if you are interested in learning about slay world i do have an entire video covering the rise and fall now at the beginning of the video, I did say something about Isaiah being able to make a song on any type of beat and making at least a decent song. But in order to get to know how he does this, we need to know his creative process. Isaiah is mostly working at home, which we see this mostly on IG Live, but he does have a couple of studios that he goes into sometimes. He's hardly ever writing down his lyrics and mostly just freestyling and punching in. He makes about five or six songs a day, and every song that he posts a snippet for most likely is going to be released. He hasn't dropped anything since 2022, but actually today he posted a snippet, and I'm hoping that he actually drops this one. And I would have put it in this video, but I actually think he already deleted it. But I am looking forward to this one, though. And one producer Isaiah works with a lot to make his music is Wi-Fi. Wi-Fi and Isaiah have known each other for a long time and Wi-Fi actually taught Isaiah how to make beats. And Isaiah has said himself that Wi-Fi plays a big part in influencing his sound. Other things that inspire him are things like paintings, cooking, watching movies, and etc. And after making this video, I'm not gonna lie, Isaiah might just be my top three favorite artists right now. My favorite song would have to be most definitely Drunk Calls. Isaiah just has so many lyrics that I do not relate to, but for some reason, I still feel them in my chest. And in my Slay Roll video, I'll put Isaiah as my third favorite in the collective, but I'm not gonna lie, he might have just moved up to two. But now my ranking is Summers, Isaiah, and then Autumn. And if you drop another project, I'ma need some more music videos. But if y'all have any good recommendations from his music, please put me on in the comments. Comments, and that was who was Isaiah TG, and I'm out. You don't give a fuck. I'm good.